Hello, my name is Bravo Child. I'm a New Zealand, Australian, South African artist traveling at the moment around the world trying to link up with artists and communities. I'm currently in New York City and I want to hold a 24 hour freestyle, cross discipline, one hour on, one hour off. The one hour on would be with a mixture of artists, jazz vocalists, theatrical improvisers, hip hop MCs, um, and the hour off would just be me ranting, rambling, and poeticizing before the next uh, assembly. So, um, I'm from New Zealand, but I've lived in Australia, both of which would be considered smaller ponds, but now I'm in New York City. I thought I might as well extend a humble yet impassioned word to people I've been inspired with for damn years. Sage Francis, Saul Williams, Aesop Rock, Shane Coizan, Reeves. You people speak to me and I want to speak with you, have a dialogue conversation. What's wrong with this notation of the fact that digital, all of these pixels are not the spit which I will fill the ceiling with peeling it off and looking back at the iris of the sky looking back down on us, drown with us because I want to be immersed in this. These verbs are sometimes the hearse that will be our epilogue, our epigraph, epitaph, sometimes these tattoos are that, the cigarette ash that is starting to engrave already staining our skin. Do not be tamed because we are the saints on a whim. We are trying to find this in the wind, this ticklish goosebump braille. We read like English. We do this with our fingertips. We do this with our pens, our paintbrushes. And as this blush begins to rush up my nervous synapse, I begin to map myself closer to you geographically. Take this tablet and smash it over your knee because it's not about the rules, it's not about the stone engravings. It's a microphone and a shaved being there, naked, quivering. Take your quiver pen and write with me. Watts. I was just in the shower and realized I didn't say Reggie Watts. I have to say Reggie Watts. Reggie Watts. So the point of this is seeing what a mind and a mind will come up with when pressed under the sponge of endurance, letting it all sweat out, all the toxins of our inhibitions or our pre-writtens or our pre-composed automaton way of interacting with each other and instead having this experiment and I think many words would be said, many ideas sparked and not finished but I think it would be a feast man, a feast, an intellectual, artistic, aesthetic, word nerd buffet and I'm damn keen I'm starving to get my teeth in it